I like putting you on the spot, Kathy, so I'm going to do it again. <laughs> and tell me a stock or two that you've dumped out of this portfolio that you didn't like and you fundamentally fell out of love and got rid of. Okay, so most recently that would have been Philip Morris. Okay. Um, the reason being is um, when we look at global leaders, our strategy is really to be investing in companies where we see good structural growth going into the future. Quality, good structural growth. And it just became very difficult for us to defend the stock. Yes, its valuation might not be where it used to be. Um, maybe they will evolve to a certain extent um, in terms of the heat not burn uh, offering. But we just felt like it was a stock that was difficult for us to continue defending in our portfolio. When they came out of the fact that they might um, merge with Altria, that was just, uh, just, we had already started lighting, but that is when we decided, no, this is, this is time for us to exit the stock. It didn't sound right. It was a decision. They decided the business split a few years ago, and now the fact that they wanted to get back together mm -hmm. um, just didn't uh, sit right with us. So we felt it was time to exit here. Yeah. So it certainly sounds like a fluid sort of process that you guys go to. Are there... Uh, meetings that are fundamentally in the diary that you cannot miss and then when, when market moves you, you hop on the phone hop on the email and you and the team get together and have discussions how does that how does that work yes so we do have our weekly investment meetings so some of the guys sit in the uk and we sit here um, but so that's great it'll be a vc as i say it's about a three-hour meeting very interactive we want ideas brought to the table However, if something does happen with one of our stocks and we feel like we have to call a meeting, yes, we definitely will. But, but the analysts are also responsible for reporting back on any news flow that may be significant to, um, to the stocks we have within the portfolio. And then again, any sort of reportings, quarterly earnings, everybody's putting out notes. Is our investment case still valid? What is our valuation now? Are we changing our forecast? So that will go out immediately um, on the day of results. So a defensive equity fund, but not a very actively managed, certainly not passively managed uh, in your mind. Very, very actively managed. Very Kathy, I think our time is up. I'd like okay. to uh, thank you for joining me this morning. I hope you have a good day. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah.